Alright, we're back with more Let's Play Dynamite Heady, but this time we're not playing anything. We're just watching the credit sequence. Sorry about that, I had to start from the title sequence and it moved to the demo rather quickly when I started up the video. This is my second take with this because the phone just interrupted me partway through the first one. As you can see, people are rather excited at the fall of Dark Demon and the revealing of Smiley to be what he truly is. Thingy's work is done. And the three friends are happy to see her off. Hetty, meanwhile, has other matters to attend to. First of all, getting rid of this stupid clingy smiley badge. Looks like he's gonna have to continue working that out, folks. As you can see, people are already starting to deconstruct the stupid set that Dark Demon put up behind the other one for the scene change. But don't worry, they're going to replace it with something much nicer looking. Perhaps rather than the jagged cliffs and red, or a possibly toxic sky, they're going to have some nice green hills, a blue sky, perhaps a small bit of water running through, similar to what you'll find in some of the earlier levels. In any case, this is a really awesome song, and you'll see they've already taken away the opening demo sign. And even though they've made a lot of progress, they've still got quite a bit to go in deconstructing this set. For example, it looks like King Dark Demon's Tower is still there. And... What could that be? I'll give you one guess. Yep. That's right. Now, I wouldn't mind seeing a sequel to this game, actually, with Mariyama as one of the main villains. And here we go, our curtain calls. Mark, Luke, Matthew, and John. Listed in that order. Paul. Paul, again. And yet another Paul, like the one that's all bothering you at the start of that last level. Though in the first level, they're nothing more than an interesting little effect. Teruso Kuhn, the crazy robot collector. Super Red Arrow. Do you see a red arrow on there anyway? All I see is a yellow aircraft. So we've got here Mrs. Carol, Duck, Mr. Kiyosaku, Bobo, and Mr. Porter. And the Dark dra dark Demon Soldiers, one with a sword, one with a periscope, and one that shoots bombs at you. You've got here Catherine, Degoon, Honeywon 1, and Honeywon 2. Starting with the level 2 enemies now. And then we've got Hunter Joe, and Hunter Dog, and Happy Cum Cum. The first two you meet when you're small, and the other one, the frickin' Snake Eyes dude we met earlier. Flying Soldiers, from level 3, the underground areas. More underground lovelies, Netter, Bob, and the Under Soldier. The Under Soldier just stands around and nearly falls off the platform. Clowny, our great friend from South Town level. Level 4, and Rebecca from behind the scenes of South Town area, I guess. And the Brownie Bonbons. We shoot them at the wall, and then they don't seem so happy. Super Machine Tank 4? Where were the other three? Oh, well, whatever. It was hard enough getting rid of that one. And Funky Ron Mel, I believe that said. Crazy Ron Mel. Momoiro Gozen. Those guys were on the stupid platforms we wanted to take sometimes. The Balloon Kellys, getting in our way since the start of the rotating level stage, the tower thing. Stage 5, I guess. Armored Soldier. Him. He is not worthy to kiss the soles of our shoes because he sucks so much. Go Moon Rocket, Backspeeder, and j -Ron from the shoot 'em up stage 6. And Sky Jaws, another one of those evil, evil mini-bosses. Mackenzie and Mackenzie and Steven and Sam. Doing little more than sitting around and minding their own business, except for that one that sounded like a cat and needed to be destroyed. 
the base captain. Fuck him so hard. Muscle Nasunas and Beth and Robinson from the crazy dark demon level castle thing. Taro and the head spitter. The Venus heady trap in the US. Shogun, Mary, Trick Hat, and the Floor Sweeper. Don't know about, I don't know, something there or something else. The Thunder Captain. And the Pachinko Sub. And Ojizo, the purple dude that we destroyed for a secret bonus point. Julian, the little freaky fangirl gotten in our way in Battle Tanky. Mario and Netten, our special guest mini-boss, to the tune of Onami Konami. Bounty Bounty, our first key master. He looks so freaky, like he's made of air balloons or something. Or, yeah, whatever, balloons. Flavel balloons. Jacqueline Dressy, our favorite wooden dress-up doll. Motor Hand, he's cool and he wasn't very difficult to deal with either, thankfully. And of course, the one, the only, the inevitable, Mitsuru, babyface. Yayoi, the gatekeeper, part one. Izayoi, Yayoi's sister, the gatekeeper, part two. <laughs> Barring the way to the tower. River Face, or Twin Freaks, or whatever. And Hyotoko Guy and Okami Gal. And King Dark Demon himself. The Smiley Badge, drunk with power. Maruyama and Kuma Body. Incidentally enough, his body is actually a bear. Octopus Trap. I mean, he was trouble brewing in the US, brewing as in bear. And there we go, the Tail Hanger. From the tower stage. Octopus trap, thankfully we didn't have to deal with. Bounty Bounty took care of that. The tower crasher. From the lovely tower stage. Yeah, we've got the backstage tower stage. Chris Wheel, the flying stage. And then... Mariyama and the spider phantom. Don't know what's up with the S. F. In the US version, it was called the super finagler. Yeah, that machine sucked hard. And here are their actual names that I've gotten wrong so many times. Mokun, Yakun, and Fukun. And good old Fingy, or as I like to call him, Heather. Or her, I said him, kinda. I mean her. And Smiley, King Dark Demon without the insane. And if you don't know who this is, I think you need to start watching the whole thing from the beginning.